Hey guys, welcome back to Feed the Beast with me, Neku, and yeah, I'm cooking up some soul sand, which I happily went and harvested from the nether, along with more glowstone. Oh, oh yeah. I was like, I saw that in the furnace a second ago. Why do I have spare? Then realized I have a system in place that moves things. Yeah, this guy's new. And this takes cooked essence, which you make like this. There we go. Um, which you cannot shift click in there. I did not know that. That's interesting. Uh, and yeah, so we need to put this in here. And I also want to put some of this in here as well. And you'll see the exact reason why I want these. So let's just put that in there. Oh, and my stone is done. But yeah, today we're going to be working with this and, oh, excuse me, I need, need to sneeze. Sorry about that. That was a violent sneeze from out of nowhere at all. But yeah, okay. So we're smelting up a lot of soul sand. There's some more. because I want to, well it takes a lot of this and a lot of time as you can see this is going to take a while so I'm going to let this go and also I'm going to tell you what we're going to do well one thing we're going to do is we're going to make a farm for this these guys, this guy, these, these two guys hopefully but that probably won't be an immediate thing simply because of the fact that oh shut up these are also going to die horribly but there's going to be because uh, you need I think it is for tier 5 soul shard you need 1024 I believe and that's for oh, excuse me it's like early in the morning so early in the morning so I'm a little bit stuffy for no reason but yeah that's for a ha the highest tier soul shard and that will spawn like entities like crazy and can be turned on and off with a redstone signal but obviously that means you have to kill 1024 cows or chickens or whatever else and I only have two cows but you can use uh, this is probably going to take a couple of diamonds as well instead of just one you can get a tier 5 of something else and throw them both in an anvil and it will turn the tier 5 say sheep spawner and if you if you anvil it in with a tier 1 cow spawner or tier 0 one kill cow spawner it will make a tier 5 cow spawner or soul shard sorry as far as I know anyway so let's not, let's not go up, get this too backed up uh, yeah that's, that's fine oh wow um, that's a lot I'm gonna run out of glow stuff I don't think we're going to be making all of that into thingy but yeah then we can make a cow farm 
and then there's going to be an XP farm which is going to go with that this episode hopefully so I'll um, just let let the diamonds smelt or whatever be corrupted and I'll be right back do you see it I see it I see it well I also see where it is it's in lag central so pensive voice let's try and see what we can get in this village oh yeah I like villages show me the village where is it oh I think it's spawned in quite a precarious position oh yep okay let's get in there let's see what we can find hopefully something good a library would be beautiful Farms. Farms always good. We like farms. Oh wow. Okay. Right. I need to eat. Let's get up here. Uh. Don't see a library. Not yet. Anyway. More farms. Ooh, cows. Hey, cow. Ow. Ow. Oh, poo. Didn't bring any blocks with me. Ooh, a blacksmith. Is that a library? No. I will go to the blacksmith. Put some stairs up and everything. Don't even come at me, bro. I'm busy. Ooh! Can replace my crowbar. I love finding crowbars. It's hilarious. Now what's in this one? Be a library, please. Yes. Oh, yes. I'm just going straight in. Hey, library guy. You want books for emeralds? No, thanks. I'm taking your books though. Oh, beautiful. Thank you. I'll fix your house for you though, guy. Um, thank you, trees. It's definitely the trees' fault that I'm getting that lag. Uh, what else have we got? More, more cows. Ooh, lots of leather from this cow. This tree is dying. Oh wow! Lag spike. Right, I'll be back with you when I get back. Hey guys, I'm back after lots of tackling lag, which was bit of a bitch, I had to reload and not load and it it took a lot of hassle that it really shouldn't have took really so yeah I'd, I also died again but I got my stuff, I wasn't far from home the lag dis I think the, the lag wasn't the uh, biome for once it was just something being an absolute 
penis so alright we have that those bookshelves so let's I don't know why I'm coming down here the enchantment tables there Right, where to put my enchanting room? Uh, let's have a little. I kind of want it in my form tower, but seeing as though I can't exactly do that right now, I'll make a temporary home for it here Does that go? Fourteen. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Yeah, that makes sense. So it took a while, guys. I've been. Well, these are probably going up again now, but I've been abusing my cow pit of. Whoa, don't do that guys. Um uh, yeah. <laughs> Wheat farm cows I left the I just bred them for like a few days. As you can see I got my vial vial sword. Cause when I left off I went to the end end the nether sorry and I killed a lot of blaze a lot of blaze and I also took with me another shard for blaze destroyed the spawner before I left so we also have a tier 2 blaze shard but this was surprisingly easy to get. Just kill a lot, kill a lot of cows. Uh, we'll sleep, and then I'll be back with you when I start the spawner farm thingy. Okay, guys, I've got the uh, necessary stuff. Um, I've started building more of a frame to the place. And I'm probably going to put some glass around the edges. But first, I want to get the system in place. So, I need to put this up here and rotate it. There we go. So this is a transposer, it should, uh, I don't know if I want it to go that way, let's do it like this. That should, yeah. C 
come on. You should pick up there. Hmm. I may need another one. I didn't want to have to have another one. Transposers are really easy to make. I'll just show you the quick mm. making of one. Da -da -da. Yeah, I got another dog. I don't know where the. Hmm. I've got another dog somewhere. Right, I need another piece of iron. Iron. Wood. There we go, and piston plan. There we go. Let me go about this. Transpose it. Right now, I need to make sure I've still got my red alloy, alloy wire. Yep, I only need one. We're doing for time. We're fine. We're all right. All right. So this wants to go. Well, first we want to place this. Then there. And I'll jump down this way. I'll get back up a different way. This will take all the items. Uh, <laughs> cobble. Yep, there we go. So when this ticks, that ticks that way. Let's just get out. It's a lot higher than the last one. How we get? Get the feeling that's a creeper hole. I'll just fill that in. No big deal. Yep. There you go. Right. Now that should. Yep, yeah, right. And that's pumping out here. Be able to close this off now. Well, I will be able to when I have put down the killing mechanism. <sighs> please work, please work, please work. That might work a little bit too well. Can we get that back? Yes, we can. Set this back one more. Make this cobble to be safe. There we go, we've got a nice lava blade going there. 
that doesn't necessarily have to be that. We're going to have this going into two barrels because we only really want two drops from this. So, a barrel there and a barrel there. Okay, so I've changed a few things and I've got some food here. Now, I don't think most of them will be able to spawn anywhere. I put half subs on the top, so oh, and I've installed this. But now, hopefully, we won't get any spawning like on top or anywhere like that. And as you can see, sometimes we get raw. Sometimes we get cooked, we get sometimes we get leather. It's fairly consistent. As you can see. <laughs> it's always cool, yeah. And we always we get, sometimes we get a few stragglers. But I think that will be solved if I like half slab. No, that's not a half slab. If I half slab up, half slab, half slab the sides as well. Maybe. Get in there. So if I put half slabs across here, I don't think they'll be able to get in here. In fact, I might may even do it like this on both sides. I have no reason to go on top. I don't think it will actually spawn them on, on top now. I still get experience from killing these ones, so. bad guys around and everything leave me alone a minute I'm busy and I think that's a nice design as well so we get to watch it kill we get a lot of food I'm just gonna leave that one in a sec That will cause a bit of lag while I walk away from it every time, but I'm, I don't intend to leave it up running on running for long periods of time. So here we go. Go and check on it. Leather for days. Right, let's put some of this crap away. Go away. There you go. And then just clear this up so that I can get to it a little bit better. Yeah, there we go. There is a mob farm. Obviously, we need to keep this area nicely lit. There's a lot of guys behind us. Let's make that in the middle. Yeah, none are spawning on top that I can see. Thanks to the half slabs. And all we have to do is just if we want food or whatever, 
just run this for a while. Hmm. I can't complain, that's very really nice. And I'm not too sure about this gap here. I may do what I've done here. The back I may leave all glass just in case. But yeah, I like that. I'm proud of it. And I don't need to keep that leather on me. Or this. There we go. Then you just turn it off. I think a few things do burn up, that's why we hear the lot of burning noise. But I'm not not too sure whether that's what it is. But yeah, there you go guys. Next time next one of these I think we need a blaze spawner for experience. But I think that will probably be I don't know, I might keep all my spawners in this area, I have like a big killing area, death zone. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time when we'll probably be doing the Thorn Tower. Peace.